Hello, greetings, salutations, everybody, and welcome to the channel of Flash with today's episode of The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past Randomizer, starring Phoenix Wright. And today might be the final day I'm saying this because this might be the finale if everything goes well, which, knowing my luck, it may or may not happen. I mean, I guess that's pretty much everybody's luck. You know, either lucky or not lucky. I don't think there is an average luck. I mean, unless you're like lucky half of the time and really unlucky the other. All right, today's today we're gonna uh, let's pull out the map. We're gonna. I figure the best thing to do would be to go to those two dungeons so that we can find the the silver arrows in them, possibly, maybe. If the silver arrows are not in those dungeons, well, I guess this series is gonna go on even longer than I intended. I mean, it already has. I did not expect it to take this long. Even though the only reason it is taking this long is because of me. Ah, oh, I wanted to hit it with the sword beam, not my sword. Physical sword. Whatever. Um. Oh, that's right, I gotta go to Kakariko Village and get the bird statue. Uh, I guess I'll meet y'all over there. <laughs> See you later! Alright, here I am at the bird statue, like I said I was gonna do. <laughs> See, y'all can trust me. Do I ever lie? I never lie. Never, never, never. So, where's our trusty... Wait a minute. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. I thought I got, like, cheated out of my... Cheated out of my shit. I just had to be quiet there because I really like that melody. It's a nice, soothing melody. It's a very... Merry melody, if you will. Okay. Finally, I can come over here now. After all this time, this is finally available to me. I mean, to us. This is a let's play, even though I'm the only one playing. But still, I want to have the audience immersed with me. This isn't a my play. It's a let's play, okay? Anyway, we're gonna use a mirror over here. In order to get... <sighs> oh, I thought I was gonna, like... Have to... Take me back into the dark world because I got stuck in... Oh, I don't need that. I don't need it! I don't Oh, come on! <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. What is this? This is stupid! At least I got the bird. Cool! Let me in! <laughs> the one times invincibility frames actually work against me. Uh, wait, can I go- Oh, move! Can I even go inside? I don't know if I have the item. Yeah, I need the lightning bolt. Do I have it? No, I don't have it. I don't know where it is. Fuck. Okay, I'm just gonna go inside here. I don't know what's inside, but... Something good? Oh, it looks like something. Ooh, a couple of treasures. Treasure. My pleasure. Treasure. Little pleasure. Oh, there's hearts. Dang. Dang, 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 dang. Okay. So this place is a bust. Oh, right. I gotta go back into the light world. Ugh. That's the most annoying thing about this game. Even in the original vanilla, always having to start off and start off inside a wall. It's so annoying. 
I wish I would just, like, tell you that you're inside a wall before you even use the mirror. I don't know how they would do that, but come on, they'd find a way. Alright, was that a five? I forgot what the other... Oh no, it was on Turtle Rock. I think it was on Turtle Rock. I'm pretty sure it's on Turtle Rock. Uh, I sure hope it's on Turtle Rock, or else I don't know what I'm gonna do. Ah, oh, you gotta be shitting me! I need a, I need another lightning bolt. Ah! I don't know what to do now! <sighs> the only thing I can do now is go around the city, the country, whatever Hyrule is, kingdom? Go all over the map looking for miscellaneous caves and holes I can fall in. Just for the sake of... <sighs> just for the sake of finding... Just oh my god, I can't even get my words out, man. Man, oh man. Fuck. What do I do now? I might just look at the spoiler log again. I know that's cheating, but come on. I don't know what I'm supposed to do now. I mean, I already used it once before to get the mirror. Uh, would it really be so wrong to look at it again? I mean, this is my very first randomizer, so... I'm bound to make mistakes here and there and stumble along the way. It's not my f Oh! I totally forgot about Ganon's Tower. I can go here and get some stuff here. Because I was thinking, like, I would just go over to- wait, hold on, what's over here? Wait a minute. Oh yeah, anyways, I was just thinking that I would just go directly to the pyramid. Because the pyramid's already open. And the only thing I need to get inside is for Ganon. Or, the seven crystals, so I can fight Ganon, so... That's what my plan was gonna be if I could find the silver arrows, because I don't think I can beat the game without silver arrows? I don't think so? I could be wrong about that, too. I know for a fact in the, or the original, not vanilla, but original, like, actual NES Zelda, you needed to kill Zelda. I mean... <laughs> You needed to kill Ganon with the silver arrows. But I think in this game, actually, you can do it without. I just think it'll take a bit longer, but I don't think it's impossible. Uh, do I want to do that? You know what? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to... I'm going to do everything I can in here. And if I don't find the silver arrows, I'm just going to kill Ganon with, without him. And I'm just stumbling all over my words today. And I'm not even tired, too. It's only like 9 p.m. I'm wide awake. Oh my god, leave me alone! I guess I, I'm just naturally stumbling. I'm a natural word stumbler. Word stumbler. So I can't blame it on my grogginess anymore. Ugh. Oh, this is annoying. I don't want to do this. I'm just gonna go fight Ganon. Fuck this. I really don't want to do this dungeon. It's long. I have two fairies. I should be good. I'm gonna go and heal up. Actually, no. What am I doing? I'm gonna save and quit. It should start me off at the pyramid now that I have the mirror. If I'm not mistaken. But hopefully I'm not mistaken. Oh wait, no, I am mistaken. 
Fuck. I could have sworn it started me off at the... At the pyramid. I don't know why it doesn't do that. Does it just straight up not do that in randomizers? Because I thought if you save and quit in a dark world, you always start off in a pyramid. That's weird. And I also thought, like, maybe it's because I don't have all the crystals, but now I do have the crystals. But also, maybe it's because I don't have the mirror. You know what? I know what it is. I have to beat Aghanim. I can't beat Aghanim since I don't have the all the pendants. Uh, that's why the portal that I just went through, the portal in Hyrule Castle, doesn't work. Or isn't activated yet. God damn, what is happening right now? I don't know what's going on. I need a focus. Focus, focus, focus. But focus on what? My commentary or my gameplay? Because from the looks of it, they both seem pretty awful right now. Because I can't even think of where to go to activate the dark portal. Oh, wait, no, right there. What am I doing? Duh. Oh, come on. Let me lift up my rock in peace. So I just, because I gotta say peace out to you. Whatever. Oh. Uh, dark world. Let's see. What a, do I have everything I need to even fight Ganon? I'm pretty- the only thing that I need are, like, the candle, I need the lantern, the fire rod, I have that. Oh, speaking of which, I should probably fill up on magic. Maybe get a green potion. Uh, is there a magic potion shop around? Ah, it's gonna be way in the top right. Maybe I should just go. Yeah, it'll be worth it. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna take the bird over there. Take the bird over to the witch's hut. Get me some green magic for what I need. Ganon. Dwarf. Oh, man. You know what it is. It's because I haven't done this. I haven't recorded in a long, long time. So now I'm just like, trying to get back into the groove, trying to get back into the rhythm. But that's hard, man. I have to like, I have to keep going for a little bit longer, maybe two, three more minutes until I finally get completely warmed up. And then my commentary is gonna skyrocket. Ooh boy, I can't wait till that happens. But until then, we're just stuck with this. Subpar, lackluster, half asleep, not really half asleep, fully awake, but my mind's not fully awake. Commentary. With lots of awkward pauses and silences and nonsensical ramblings. Like I'm some kind of old man with dementia. And I'm not even an old man yet, I'm still in my 20s. So I've got a ways to go before I get thought. Dementia, Alzheimer's, Alzheimer's, not Alzheimer's, Alzheimer. It's a weird word. <sighs> Anyways, let's go kill Ganon. Ooh, I wonder if like they're gonna change the Ganon model to be like Edgeworth. No, it wouldn't be Edgeworth. Edgeworth is a friend. Maybe it's gonna be like. Godot, or Godot, however you say his name. I always forget. I know they said it in the anime, but I forgot how they said it. I think it was Godot. Kind of like Gal Godot. Uh, I want to, I really want a heart. Fuck, what am I doing? I'm just gonna get a fairy from this tree. Not that tree. This tree. Yes! Move! Enemies! Yeah!
Yeah, baby. Please don't hit me. I want to be at full health. What? Wait a minute. I thought I needed to... I do have all seven crystals. Oh. I guess I really do have to beat that fucking temple. Fuck me. Everything I know is a lie. I hate randomizers. I'm never doing a randomizer ever again for as long as I live. At least I'll link to the past. Fuck this game. I'm sick of this game. I don't know why this happens to every single game I let's play. Every time he draws near the end, I just get so irritated and agitated. I just want it to end. Except for the Smurfs. I could have kept going with the Smurfs. I like that game. Then again, Wizard of Oz. That's kind of an extreme example, just since that game was shitty from the start. But no, this game. This game is good. This game is cool. I mean, it'd be a lot cooler if I actually knew what I was doing most of the time, but I just don't know this game well enough for me to successfully do a randomizer and, like, not get stuck around and jumbled about. But whenever the inevitable Ocarina of Time randomizer comes on this channel, then I'll be all, I'll be all over that. Since I actually do know that game really well. Well enough to do a randomizer. Not well enough to do glitches, though. I'm not that- I'm not at that level yet. I've never been a glitcher. A glitcher guy. A guy for glitches. Glitches and stitches. You'll leave me in stitches whenever you break my britches. Anyways. Um, what was I saying? Right, I gotta go and do that temple again. I hope I don't need that magic powder. I don't think... I don't think I need any more items, actually. The only... Th except for the silver arrows, but again, I think I can beat Ganon without them. I'm pretty sure I can. Mm. Man, I can't believe this game's almost over. I haven't even decided what my next game's gonna be. The next Let's Play. Uh, who knows, who knows, who knows? If I... It's gonna still be something I have to play on the computer, though, since... I don't have, like, the means, the proper means. Oh, wait, what am I doing? I know, right? Oh, <laughs> I thought I was in the light world version. Whoops. <laughs> no, we're in the dark world. Right? Yeah. But yeah, I don't have, like, the proper means to record from my TV. I mean, I do, but it's weird. My computer is really bad at it. Like, I had done multiple test recordings of, like, games on my PS4 and, uh, and even my GameCube and Nintendo 64. But for, they always come out really laggy. Like, the... Motion, not motion capture, but, uh, video capture or software capture. The capture program I'm using, what was it, Dazzle, I think? I don't know which version, I just know it's a Dazzle. But yeah, it records games, but it comes out all laggy. Laggy and skippy and bad. So I don't know if it's a problem with the DVD recorder or just a problem with my really bad computer. I mean, either way, I'm probably gonna wait till I get a new computer before I even start... Uh, start finagling with all that stuff. But until then, I just have to use my screen recording software to capture footage and whatnot. I guess I... I guess I shouldn't really be too concerned about which items I get, because 
if it's not the silver arrow, it doesn't really matter. And any other item is just gonna be sur superfluous at this point. But yeah, the only thing that really matters now is just... Uh, actually getting to the end of the dungeon so that Ganon can go turn into a bat and break open the door. Break over, break open the pyramid wall. Can I go in here? I mean, I know I can go in here, but is it worth it? I'm concerned about the keys, too. Oh, thanks, game. One rupee. I don't know what that did. What did that do? Nothing. Ugh. What a shame. It's just a shame, that's all! Da -da 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 -da. You can see black and I see white! Or something, I don't know how the words go. Something, something! It's just a shame, that's all! I'm so sorry, Phil Collins. Phil Collins and all the other band members of Genesis for ruining that song. That's a good song. Genesis is a good band. I love Genesis. I love anything Phil Collins. But we're not here to talk about Phil Collins, we're here to talk about me getting inside the portal. Come on! Okay. Oh man. I didn't even realize it, but I'm about to die. That's no bueno. No bueno. No bueno indido. Indido. Ah! Ah! Oh, good thing I had another key. I probably took the wrong portal. Or maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was the right portal. I mean, left portal. I don't know. You know what I mean. Whoa! Right way, this way, not that way. This way, down here. Hey! Come on. It's just taking me to the same spot. What a jip. Uh, have I been here yet? I think this is the one I came from. So I'm gonna go in this one. Maybe I should have taken that portal up on the right. That might have been a smarter choice. Oh, maybe it wouldn't have been a smarter choice, because apparently this is the smartest choice I could have taken. <laughs> I'm a lawyer, you know? I always make smart choices. That's why I got a perfect score on my bar exam, because I'm always raising the bar. Just like... AT&T? No, that's not the company. Verizon? I don't know. I don't know corporate logos. Or slogans. I don't know corporate slogans. Cause I'm not into corporations, man. All they want to do is bring us down. Ugh. Haha, <laughs> like that guy just got brought down. Little bitch. <laughs> I'm Phoenix. But I don't have a big key, man. I don't want ten arrows. Have I been here before? Oh, yes. Wait, did I skip this last time? Well, some lawyer I turned out to be. I'm so negligent. Come on, Phoenix, you gotta be smarter than that. You gotta look at all the evidence in the court record and then make the best decision based on what you have. It's so obvious, man. Oh, I guess I didn't really need to take out all four. Four of them. That scared me for a second. I was like, um, how come the floor is still disappeared? But no, I just didn't see the switch. Fuck! Good thing I got fairies. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Oh! Giddy, giddy, goo! 
giddy, giggity, 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 giggity. I can't do quagmire. What am I doing? I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> What? Come on. Is this close enough for your highness's liking? Thank you. Okay, um... Ooh, ooh, I'm gonna die. Wait, here I go, here I go. Yes! I did it. I completed my mission. Sometimes in life, you just gotta go for it. Don't think about it, just go for it. Because the more you think, the less likely you are, the less likely you are to actually do the action. You, sometimes in life, you don't go for the reaction. You just gotta take action, take life by the horns, and just throttle, go full throttle, like that shitty Charlie's Angel movie. No, not the newest shitty Charlie's Angel movie, but the other one. Wait, what am I talking about? I haven't seen either of those movies. I don't even watch Charlie's Angels. Uh, I'm not saying it's a bad show or anything, but... I don't know, I just never... been much of a Charlie's Angels guy. And I see a cracked wall over there. Hey, wait! I wanted to check out the cracked wall! Oh, oh boy. I thought I was gonna die. But I'm a phoenix. Phoenix never dies. Cause like a phoenix, he will rise. Or something. How's that song go? That one David Guetta song. There'll be no time for crying. When darkness fills the sky, we'll go on forever. Like a phoenix, we will rise. Wait, I thought this was supposed to light up the floor. Ugh, must be the other one. Yeah, oh, was it over here? Oh, shit. Fuck, this is gonna be a lot of trial and error. I don't know what I'm gonna... Do. Hey, fairy. Thanks for bringing me back to life. Thanks, Tinkerbell. And it's gonna start me off all the way over there every time. Oh, that's fantastic. Not really. You know what? Oh yes, there we go. Yeah, man! That's how we do it! That's the only way to succeed, yo! Woo! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Huh? I thought I was supposed to do something, but nothing was done. Ugh. Uh, bombs away? Oh, don't take my magic, please. I need that to kill you. Shit, 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 leave me alone. Okay. Phoenix, let's go down the hole. Phoenix, take out your bow. Phoenix, it's time to show these armos who's your bro. Ah, this is why I don't freestyle. Ugh, why does it have to be on ice? What is this, some kind of... I don't know, Disney show? Disney on ice? I've never actually been to any of those... I've never been to an on ice show, period. I guess I just can't handle the cold. I mean, I lived in Texas my whole life, so of course I can't handle cold. No, wait, no, no. I think I wanted to go into top one first. Fuck. Oh, wait, no. Aw, oh, thank god I didn't have one heart left. That would have been very disappointing. Actually, 
Ah, uh, I wanted to bring it like right in front of me, not like inside of me, just so I can capture it. But hey, everything worked out in the end. Everything always works out in the end for Phoenix, right? I mean, unless you're like playing Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 in which you're like a really shitty Phoenix Wright player in which the opponent makes things not right in the end for you because you got your ass beat by an overpowered Magneto and Wolverine and Zero combo. I don't even know if those guys are like top tier or anything. Those are just the names that just came to mind whenever I think of that game. Even though I never even play as any of those characters except for Zero. I play as Zero sometimes, but he's not like my go-to guy. Not in that game. He was my go-to in uh, in Capcom Marvel Infinite, the newest one. The Zero Doctor Strange combo, that's who I always played as. And then I also played as X and Captain Marvel, because I really like Captain Marvel in that game. This was before the movie came out, and then Captain Marvel became synonymous with, uh, whatever her name is. <laughs> the name of that, the actor, actress who plays her, his name I can't remember, but she, like, takes personal attacks or something, I don't know. Brie Larson, that's it, Brie Larson. Yeah, that was before I played as a, I mean, not that I stopped playing as her because of her, because of Brie Larson. I mean, I just stopped playing that game altogether. I played it for like two days. I beat the story mode in like a day. Not even a day. It was like two days, actually. But after I beat the story mode, I was like, uh, what's left to do? Yeah, <laughs> literally nothing. I mean, I could go online, but it was so hard finding a match online. I, it was really hard. It took a really long time. Nobody played that game at all. I mean, I can see why, that game's... I'm not gonna straight up say it's a bad game, but it's just really... I don't know, boring? I don't, I don't wanna say boring, but it's like... I don't know how to describe it. It's not as fun as it could be. I mean, I guess you could literally say that about any game ever. But especially with this game. Like, I got way more enjoyment out of... Um, Ultimate Marvel, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. But then again, that's only because it has, like, Phoenix right in it, so of course. He was the only character I played as. He was in every single team comp I ever had. Even though the only people I played as was Phoenix Wright, Tron Bond, and Frank West. Because those are cool characters. I like them. I like them a lot. I like Tron Bond and her giant ass mech. Even though I've never actually played her game, I never played Mega Man Legends before. Same thing for Frank West. I never I don't even know what games he's from. He was from like a zombie game, I forgot the name. Dead Rising was it? I wanna say Dead Rising. It's kinda weird how Capcom has like multiple zombie games. It's like What's their fixation with zombies? I guess people really like zombies. I wonder if there was ever like a Dead Rising and Resident Evil crossover game. Uh, that'd be kind of cool, I guess. Even though I don't really like, I don't like Resident Evil. It, it's very boring to me. But then again, I only played the first one. Not even the first one. I the only Resident Evil game I played was a remake of the first one, because I got it for free on the PS4. I don't, I don't remember how I got it for free, but I just know I got it for free. I think there was some kind of special or something. I don't remember. Yeah, I played it. It's like, man, I hate this game. It's so slow, and I don't know where to go. I got stuck. And then it's like you can only save your games like three times or something. But like, oh, you have to collect these special file icons or whatever to save your game. It's like, what? That's stupid. Like, I have, I have shit I need to do in life. I can't just limit the amount of saves I have to a game. What? That's stupid. But whatever. Not even that, not even only because of that, but the game was so boring. 
I mean, I guess other people really enjoy it for some reason, but I... Oh, come on. I was taking my magic as I was falling. That's not fair. Oh, I don't even have arrows. I only have six arrows. <laughs> Fuck. Whatever. I don't need arrows to beat these guys. But, yeah. Anyways. A long Capcom Resident Evil rant aside. Um, this should be the boss room. Or like close to the boss room up ahead. On the top path. The northern path. Ugh. This is annoying. I really should have had that arrow upgrade. I should have got the arrow upgrade. I don't know if that's randomized or not. The fairy fountain that gives you... Ooh, that was cool! But yeah, the fairy fountain that gives you arrow and bomb upgrades if you give her rupees. I don't know if that's randomized or not. Regardless, I probably should have checked it out. But hey, live and learn. Hey, didn't he didn't even go red. Phoenix, please get into the door. Thank you. Oh, what do we have here? Heh. <laughs> nice. Cool. That's, that's cool. Cane of Samaria. Or a cane of... Was it Pachi? 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 Pachai? Whatever the word is. But no, that's not where the boss room is. Where is the boss? What the fuck? Where am I going? Hmm. There must be some kind of door I missed. Some kind of locked door. Oh, I know where it is. What the hell? I know where it is. Come on. No, not here. No, no, no. Well, yes, here. What am I doing? Yeah, just go up here. And then I gotta go into top center right over here. Wait, have I been here already? Oh! I'm pretty sure I have. No, yeah, I have. But, like, before I came back, when I came here the first time, I just said, oh, fuck this, I'm gonna go, fi I'm gonna go fight Ganon. But, yeah. So, I've, I've returned. Nope, not this guy. This guy, right here. Yes, that's him, officer. Right here. Right here. Right over there. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. Continue. Ha! <laughs> yeah! Oh, there's more of these guys I have to kill. Please leave me alone. Fuck you! Or maybe I can just push up. Oh, this is gonna turn into hell. I would bring out the, the blue cane to give me invincibility, but that means I can't even kill them because I can't have that and whip out the arrows at the same time. Hey, that's cool. I don't have a big key. Fuck. Can I shoot you? I have a small key. Something is missing. The big key. You don't say. I know where it is. I'm pretty sure it's in that room with the cracked wall in it. I have to somehow find a way to get into that cracked wall. But how am I going to do that? How? How, I say. Mm. Isn't that the million dollar question? <laughs> Too bad I don't have a million dollar answer. I have a budget dollar store answer. And that dollar store answer is... I don't know. Get good. Get good, kid. Okay. I just wanted to make sure I have all the fairies. Or all the bottles in my fairy filled up. Hey! Leave me alone, friend! Oh, I should have saved that. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. All good in the hood.
I'm still alive! Now what do we have here? Oh, I thought I was gonna get hit right there. Hey! Oh, move, move, get out of my way. Please move! Shithead. Okay, none of these blocks are being pushed. Whatever. Yes! Oh, I missed! Stop missing, come on. Phoenix right! Just do right. Dude, what am I doing? What is happening? Ah, I ran out of time. There are just too many obstacles in my way. Okay, let's try this again, shall we? There we go, right there, right there. Okay, gotta go here. Oop. Gotta watch that. <laughs> it's not like Timmy Turner. Anyways. Wait, what, what did that open? What door did that open? I wasn't paying attention. Fuck me. Ah, oh, I have to do it backwards. I gotta go ass backwards up in this mofo. Oh, it's a good thing I got the magic potion. Okay, let's take it from the top. <laughs> Literally. Oh! Okay. Ah, oh, fuck, wrong way. Get in there, get in there. Yes! I did it! Time to whip out the bombs! Woo! Ah, oh, I didn't want to bring out two of them! Yeah! What a neat little puzzle. I'm glad A Link to the Past is experimenting with ways to use our items in creative ways. I said ways twice. Redundancy. Thy name is Phoenix. I mean, not Phoenix. I'm the one talking, not Phoenix. Redundancy. Redundancy. Thy name is the channel of Flash. Okay. 50 rupees. This has to be the big key, right? Or another shoe. Wait, I just got the big key. What am I talking about? Oh, where's this taking me? Yow! That's shocking! Ooh. Okay. This dungeon is seriously kicking my ass. And I cannot allow- Oh, what is with the graphics over here? It's like cut off. Was it always like this? This looks really awkward. And I know a thing or two about awkward. Another key? How many keys are in this dungeon? I thought I was getting close to the end, but apparently... No! Give me that magic bottle! No, run! It's there. Yes! That's neat. Oh. Okay. Random key to open this random door. I feel like they could have just made it, like, kill all the enemies in the room for it to automatically open kind of thing. But, hey, I'm not a game designer. What do I know? I'm just a filthy consumer who buys the games, you know, putting bread on the game developers' tables. Because fans are important. No! Okay. I might just take out the cane of Samaria. Or... Hachi? Yeah, yeah! Try to stop me now! You can't, can't ya? <laughs> okay. Um, how do I get to the middle? I don't know if I can. Oh, you know what? No. no. Fuck! I hate playing on a keyboard. My inputs are so unprecise. Like, I can't just make a tiny little step. It always goes in this set increment. Whereas on a D-pad, I can just slowly inch my way. But nope. Not on a keyboard. You have to commit to a full button press. I 
Show me the way. Uh, I was so close to making a Peter Frampton reference. Oh, wait, I don't have any more energy. Fuck. I don't have any more fairies to make me come alive. Oh, another Frampton reference. Two for the price of one, Grandma. Oh, that was a Chugga Conroy reference. Yeah, Chugga Conroy and Peter Frampton. What a weird. That's like two names you would never hear in the same sentence. Oh, no, this is not where I want to go. Um, wait! I know where I am. Okay. If I'm not... No, I don't want to go in that room. It's just going to take me to the Armo statues. I, I want to go to the room with the big door. And the big key. Oh, here we go. Okay. Um, I appreciate the gesture, but I'm dead. Oh, I had to get it in a good stretch. Oh, yeah, that felt good. I was hunched over for a while. Oh, boy. Anyways, I'll, I'll meet y'all back in the room with the big door. All right. I'm here to upgrade my arrows. I know this is this might seem like a sudden change of pace from where we were, but I need the arrows to defeat the I need the arrows to defeat the people. The armor statues and the little red guys. And I'm glad we don't have to go through that whole song and dance of her of me throwing into arrows into rupees. And whatnot. Anyways. Ah, oh, I should have got another fairy. For the sake of having full health. Let's do this again. Yeah, I don't think I'll need the rupees for anything else. Okay, I got everything. All right, I'm back. Back to open the big door. So let's see what's inside. Uh huh. I hear an annoying racket. Oh. All right, that's better. No more of the <laughs> sound effect. I can't even make that sound. Hey, back off! Fucking shitheads. Ah, oh, he's standing right on top of the thing, too. Alright, here we go. No. Oh, oh boy. Okay. Ugh. Look at me, dodge and weave. They don't teach that in law school. You learned that in the school of getting your ass kicked. Fuck. Ugh, whatever. Bring me back to life, please! Hey, this room kind of reminds me of, like, The Incredibles. And that one scene where Mr. Incredible was on that long, narrow passageway, getting bombarded by those sticky bombs. <laughs> Maybe this is where they got that inspiration for that scene from. Oh, this is gonna be hell. Ugh, fuck. I have to, like... Barely inch my way. Which is, this is impossible to do on a keyboard. Oh my god. Oh, unless I do this. Oh, fuck my life. Like, I can, I can't, it's impossible to be on like the outer edge, the outer rim, and barely face up. Because like I said before, the increments, or not increments, but like, the keyboard, you have to commit to a full on button press. So I can't just inch my way. It's the full-blown press on the keyboard. Which makes it really awkward. Ha! Did you see my big brain move? 
I went, I went up into that room, so whenever I fall, I just spawn over there. Instead of all the way at the end of the hall. Oh, here we go, here we go. Yeah! Woo! You see? That's why they call me a lawyer. Because... I have to think outside the box. There wasn't even anything in here. Hey, do those fairies respawn? <laughs> nope. I wanted to catch one in my bottle. Or catch one in my net and put it in my bottle. Heh, <laughs> makes you wonder why they never brought the net back in any of the future Zelda games. Well, except for Link Between Worlds. Where it's like... Why would I use a net to put something in a bottle when I could just use the bottle directly? You know, just cut out the middleman. What am I doing? Why do For some reason I thought you had to use arrows to kill those people. But nope. The wrong red people. The other red people you gotta kill with arrows. I am not racist against red people. Take that as you will. But, I support all people and monsters, because I- monsters are cool people too, not all monsters are mean. Like that Mike Wazowski guy, he tells funny jokes and stuff. And he's a funny little meme. Him and his combined Scully face. I mean, not Scully, Sully. <laughs> Scully, scoliosis. <laughs> okay. Anyways, man, how long is this dungeon? How long is this dungeon? I gotta enunciate my words because I'm pretty sure I just said, "How long is this dungeon?" How long is this dungeon? Man, that's like a lot of extra effort you gotta put in your vocal and mouth movement whenever you say that is this is this is this is this it's so much easier just to say is this how much longer is this dungeon how much longer is this dungeon Ugh. oh it looks like it's almost done oh great another boss but I got a level 3 sword this time Ah, oh, but there's an annoying little fire guy shooting shit at me. Wow. Wow. This is the most indifferent battle sound I've ever heard. Wow. Wow. It's like, come on, man. Why are you doing this to me? Leave me alone. Wow. Whoa. It's like, they just don't give a shit that they're getting hit. <laughs> like that guy from Majora's Mask. I've always liked that noise he made. Whenever you play the song of healing, and he's like... <laughs> How his voice just goes into that higher octave during the second mode. Or third mode, I should say. Anyways, we're not here to talk about that Zelda game. We're here to talk about this Zelda game. Wizard robes. Arrows. Arrowed hearts catch fire now. Make believes reborn. I don't know where I'm standing. Oh, fuck. Uh, can I shoot him with a fire? Oh, that's neat. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I don't have the mirror shield. Not that I'll need it, I don't think. They gave me two normal shields before I ever got a regular shield. I mean, no, a mirror shield. And there I go, mixing up my words. Ooh. Oh. 
Oh, look at all the goodies. Goody, goody gumdrops. This dungeon is still going on. <laughs> I can't take it anymore. It's just the end. Okay, um... What is the best way of tackling this? First of all, I gotta get rid of all the skulls. Like this. That. And that. And that! Then I gotta run, run, run! Yes! I did it! Hey! Leave me alone. Get in there! Shit. Aw, oh, do I have any more fairies? Oh, I'm just shit out of luck if I get killed. But I've came such a long way, I don't wanna... Turn around... Oh, I'm fucked. Damn it. Okay, just gotta fall. Please don't die. Oh, where's it gonna drop me? Ah! I need a heart. Just one heart. Yeah. I get this one first. Can you please give me a heart? That's not the kind of heart I had in mind. I don't even have keys. Ah, speak of the devil. Are you can you, can you give me a heart? No? Fuck you. Bombs! Bombs away! Okay, I gotta play this smart. I know, an entirely new concept over here on the channel of Flash. But yeah, you gotta be a bit more strategic. Okay. Um. Oh, what? I did not mean for anything to get opened. This annoying ball hanging up on the side. And I need another fucking key. Are you... <sighs> Come on. Where do I get that last key? You know what? I... I still think it might be in that locked room, or in the room with that cracked door I saw, with all the portals. Or it might be in this guy right here. Heh, <laughs> nope. That would have been too easy. Fuck, I'll be right back. All right, here we go. This has to be where the key is. It's gotta be. If it's not, then I just don't know. Oh, this is a weird looking room. I assume I gotta step on one of these switches. This is such a weird texture. I don't think there's anything else like it in the game. Oh, look at all these goodies over here. I got the silver arrows. I can beat the game. Oh my god. I can do it. All I have to do is find the key. All I gotta do is find the key. And then I can finally make it home. Home. To Ganondorf. Oh, Mr. Dragmire. I'm ready to kill you! <laughs> hmm. But <laughs> yeah, I gotta find that key. I don't know where to, I don't even know where to begin. Uh 
Uh, not here. Ugh. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Yeah, there it is. There's the key. Alright, now let's let's get back to the big room. Alright, here we go. Finally. Oh great, another boss. Perfect. Let's kill this guy real quick. I should kill him in a couple of spin attacks. There we go. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, nothing to it. That's how we do it. Alright, I gotta have the hook shot. What is this gonna be? Hey, bombs. Nice. Don't care. Just get me out of here. God. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Okay, come on. I don't have any fairies left. I died a couple times getting here. Okay. Is it over? Man, oh man. Okay. A long blue carpet. Lots of candles. Boss door. Okay. I think this is it. Aghanim! Yeah, I can take you on. No sweat. Oh, don't shoot the blue balls at me. Oh, fuck. I don't really like the way they're lined up. Okay, how many times do I have to hit this guy? Oh, how did I miss both of them? Whoa, don't stand there. Yeah, that was a really awkward angle. Okay, um, here we go. Yeah, I hit him with two of them that time. Ah, oh, come Ah, oh, please, for the love of God, don't let me die here. Oh, I have another fairy. What am I talking about? I could have sworn I used up all my fairies. Oh, no sweat. <laughs> I've got fairies for days. Not really, since this is my last one. It's also very hard to align myself because, as I said countless multiple times before, playing on a keyboard is no good. I only had to hit him one more time. G -g -g Ganondorf! Blue Bat. Blue bat! Blue bat! What what are you doing here? You're not supposed to be in a dark world. Ugh. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. I know I said this was gonna be the finale, but I'm I'm a liar, I guess. Even though in, earlier in the video I said I would never told a lie, but of course. I'm not lying right now. This video will... The finale will come. I'll just record the finale in the same recording session as I'm doing as this one. So it might not appear directly in this video, but it'll appear in the next video. I don't know, I'm trying to loophole my way around this, but it's not working out. 
Anyways, I'm tired. I'm not even tired. I'm just... You know what? Fuck this. We're gonna kill this guy right here, right now. I don't have any fairies or anything. Fuck. Okay, let me go get fairies and let me go get magic. I'll be right back. All right, let's finish this off. Ganon, I'm coming for you! You drove away my other self, Aghanim, two times. Two times? But I won't give you the Triforce, I'll defeat you. Yeah, whatever. Come at me. I'll take you down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can do this guy easy. Um. Whoa, he took off a lot of damage. Maybe it won't be that easy after all. No, don't worry. I got this. Come on, go on to your second phase already. Okay. I'm glad you can do what you're told. You're good at following orders. Ah, oh, damn it. Fuck. Good thing I got fairies. I came well prepared. I also brought two, two, two blue potions. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Fuck, I wanted to use the blue potions for my magic, but... It looks like... Oh, man, those... You know what? Here's what I'm gonna do. I have another blue potion, so I can just use that whenever the magic gets low. Oh, I should have done that from the start. Okay, now we're getting to a point where he's... Where he's taken away the floor. I mean, I'm trying to like concentrate on this guy, so I can't... My commentaries might be jumbled up. But if you've been watching me this far, that's nothing new. Wow, wow. Okay. Take off the other half of the floor. Then you can make the room go dark. Stop teleporting. What is wrong with this guy? Uh. Oh no, silver, my one true weakness. Yes, you're right. I don't think he said that in the original game, did he? Okay, I'm gonna heal. I really don't remember. He might have. Oh, pff, what am I doing? Yeah, okay. Just gotta do that a few more times. Ooh, I can't believe I tried doing this without silver arrows. At least I was very considerate of doing it. I think I only have to hit him, like, what, one more time? Fuck, okay, I'm running out of magic, too, so I gotta finish this off quick. Oh, please, for the love of God, don't fall. Yes! Whew! <laughs> yeah! We did it! That's it, boys! That's it, girls! We did it! We saved the world! <sighs> and all in a randomized setting, too. I feel accomplished. I feel like I've done God's work. Or, in this case, Lady Hylia's work? Time for another one? Another what? Another credit sequence? Or another randomizer seed? Because I am not doing another seed anytime soon. No way. Not for this game, at least. Maybe if I practice a bit more. That's, that's probably my biggest flaw going into this. I didn't practice enough. I thought... Oh, I've seen a couple of randomized playthroughs on the internet, so, and I played, I beat this game like three, four, or five times in my life, so hey, I think I understand it. Then, no, it's a lot harder than it looks, because there's a lot of little nuances and 
details that I was not aware of. Such as the locations of all the little chests and stuff. Shib Shiboleth's homecoming? Who the hell is Shiboleth? I don't know, but yeah. This was an adventure and a half, to say the least. Vultures rule the desert, Dells, desert palace. <laughs> Dellers. Dellards. But yeah, <laughs> this game was tough. I had to... But I only had to use a spoiler log one time, which is a lot less than I originally thought I was going to need to use it. <laughs> but no, I feel kind of accomplished. <clears throat> As I take my victory drink of water. Mm -mm -mm. I like cash too. Me and my uncle are alike. We love the money. Little love for sale. But yeah, this was a fun experience. I have no regrets. No regrets at all coming into this game. I'm really glad I did. Because... Uh, honestly, after the shit show that was The Wizard of Oz, which for some reason is the most viewed video on my channel, for some reason, I'm not proud of that. I really wish... I honestly wish the Smurfs or this one was a lot more watched than the Wizard of Oz one, because... Honestly, I'm not gonna... I don't know how I'm gonna look back at that game in, like, years from now and say, Oh, this Let's Play was a good Let's Play. No, it was a bad Let's Play. The Wizard of Oz, I mean, not this one. I'm pretty proud of this one. But The Wizard of Oz, ugh. I wish I could, like, take all the views from that... From that video. Not even a video, it's just the first episode, mostly. That has the most views on my channel. At the current moment of recording this, I don't know why, I guess people really like Wizard of Oz, or I don't know how it even got recommended to them in the first place, but hey, can't look a gift horse in the mouth. But yeah, speaking of which, I don't even know what my next Let's Play is going to be. I don't know why I said speaking of which, as this, the previous subject and this subject were <laughs> related in any way, shape, or form, but I needed some kind of segue into that topic. But yeah. I don't know what my let's, next Let's Play is going to be. Maybe it's going to be... I don't know. I don't know what I have in mind. I was thinking about doing Mother 3. Maybe. Because I haven't had any RPGs on this channel yet. I've only had platformers and... Whatever the hell category you want to describe The Link to the Past as. Adventure? I mean, no shit, it's an adventure, but it's not platforming. Action? I don't know, who cares? Puzzle? Whatever. The explosion sleeps again. Forever. Oh, huh, yeah. But yeah, only time will tell what my next Let's Play is gonna be. And boy howdy, this was a fun Let's Play. I, I know I said I wouldn't do this again, but I might do it again. I might do another seed sometime in the future. Yeah, maybe as a live stream or something. But no, I don't want to... I want Ocarina of Time to be my um, go-to randomizer let's play, or live stream let's play, if I were to do live streaming. Because I love, I really love Ocarina of Time. It's by far my favorite Zelda game. I know a lot of people say Majora's Mask is the best, Majora's Mask is so much better, so much darker, so much deeper. Like, yeah, I mean, I, I Yes, story-wise and atmosphere, yeah, probably Majora's Mask is probably better in that regard, but if you look past all that edgy, edgy, dark, hipster shit, then it's like, you look at Ocarina of Time, Ocarina of Time just feels more complete, I want to say. I don't know. Trust me, I used to be on the same boat, too. I used to say, oh, Majora's Mask is my favorite. Back when I was a lot more edgy, edgy and angry, angrier than I used than I am right now. Because believe it or not, I used to have some major anger issues, and <laughs> I've done things in my life that I'm not proud of. And yeah, <laughs> I used to be in a very dark, a darker place than I am right now, but. It's no, that was a long time ago. That was a different me. I'm now 
the channel of Flash, where I used to be the not channel of Flash. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, but yeah, Majora's Mask this is a cool game. Ocarina of Time's a cool game too. All Zelda games are a cool game. There's no wrong answer. There's no wrong choice of having of what your favorite Zelda game is. They're all awesome. They all have every single Zelda game has a valid reason for it to be your favorite. Whether it be the original to NES, like the original NES one, I can see that be some people's favorites. Either for like the nostalgia or or just uh, for what it really accomplished during its time. Setting setting up a whole bunch of new ground, trend setting, trailblazing for a bunch of future elements to come. Zelda 2? Yeah, Zelda 2 is the only game in the series where it's that style. The side-scrolling RPG style. I can see why people would really like that. Then, of course, Link to the Past. I know, I personally know people whose favorite game this is. Link's Awakening. Link's Awakening DX. I actually don't know about DX. I've never played DX before. I mean, not DX. What am I talking about? I mean, the Nintendo Switch. Nintendo Switch Link's Awakening. I've never played that one yet. Ugh, fuck. Games are expensive nowadays. 60 bucks? And there's so many, like, good Switch games out there, too. But, like, I just can't be spending $60 on all of them. I mean, I could get them used, I guess. I don't really think it makes a difference used or new for Switch games because... If I'm not mistaken, the Switch data, like the save data, doesn't... It's not on the cartridge, it's on the actual Switch or like your account you make. So as long as the cartridge is still working fine, then it really doesn't matter if it's used or new. Uh, but yeah, for course, Ocarina of Time. Obviously, people's favorite, a lot of people's favorite, so the Majora's Mask, the Oracle games. I actually don't know anybody who's Oracle, who like really loves the Oracle games for it to be their favorite. I mean, they're really good games, but I don't know. I never really hear that many, or if any one at all, say Oracle of Seasons is the best game, or Oracle of Ages is the best game. Yeah, then what, there's Four Swords? I don't know about Four Swords. I have the one on the DSi. I don't know if that's uh, people's favorites. Minish Cap, yeah, I can see that. I can see people, kids growing up during that time period, being their, being their first Zelda game. It's like, oh, I grew up with Minish Cap. It's my favorite. Sentimental value and whatnot. Anyways, Quartz Wind Waker, Twilight Princess. We all know why those are people's favorites. Skyward Sword, yeah, that could be people's favorite too. I don't know. What am I talking about? Every Zelda game is everybody's favorite. That's the end of this Let's Play. Thank you for watching. I didn't collect everything. This is not a 100% walkthrough. Thank God. Or else we'd be here for another 20 parts. But yeah. Thank you for watching. And this has been the Channel of Flash with our Let's Play of... The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past Randomizer, starring, not featuring, starring, not Link, not Zelda, not even Ganondorf, but yes, the one and only, you know him, you love him, he's the one you want to hire whenever you're in legal trouble, it's Phoenix Wright! Yes. <laughs> Anyways, so... Adios, goodbye, and... Ugh, fuck, what did I say? I gotta go back to the end of the Smurfs Let's Play, because I had a really good outro for that. For a really good catchphrase outro. I forgot what it was. Adios, goodbye, farewell. May or may not have been in that exact order, but... Yeah. See ya, everybody. Oh yeah, I gotta give shout out to my commentary box over in the top left <laughs> always fixing my mistakes coming back to me after a, a short hiatus having to re gather his composure after he stormed out <laughs> but he's back we're friends everybody's friends friends are good friends are nice friends make the world go around and this outro has been going on for too long so <sighs> Had to take a breath. Alright. Adios. Farewell. Goodbye.